Some of you thin ass tricks don't have enough ass to keep the pussy off the sheets. <laughs> but speaking of that, something that you and Mother Ring have been going back and forth about all the time is y'all definitions of mumba rap. So this is actually, this is my final word on the list. I don't know if you got any new ones, but the definition of mumba rap, bro, what, what you got, what, what you think mumba rap is? Okay, so I call mumba rap lit rap. People seem to think that mumbo rap is just like, it can't exist. If all these other concepts can be thought of and like, you know what I'm saying? Like, okay, yeah, that's whatever. Like, oh, this is a new term. Y'all, y'all made up a new fucking term for entanglements, but y'all can't make up a fucking term for fucking mumbo rap. All of a sudden that does, that can't never exist. That's ridiculous. So, excuse me. Um, I had to pause the game to fucking tell, tell, say this one, but Mumble rap to me, lit rap, I, I threw up the quotation, is this lean shit, this yeah, a, a, yeah, uh. And before, I used to think that the mumble rap was when rappers, these young ass rappers used to rap and not finish the words. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. Oh, yeah, look at my beard. Yeah, oh, uh, look at my rear. Yeah, you know, shit like that. I thought that was mumble rap. And realistically- I think it was when people first created the term. I think that's what it was. Yeah, yeah exactly. I, I That's what I thought it was. Now motherfuckers acting like, oh, it's popular to say that mumble rap doesn't exist now. Everyone in their mama is saying that. Like, mumble rap doesn't exist. They're saying it now, but before, it was the most popular term used in rap. So you, no one can confidently tell themselves they weren't saying mumble rap, mumble rap this and mumble rap that. We all were saying mumble rap this, mumble rap that. Especially old heads, because they were using that to defunct, you know, the rap game and shit. Um, lit rap, to me, mumble rap is a style. It's a style. It's that a ya b re You know what I'm saying? Not finishing any word shit. You know what I'm saying? This new shit. J. Cole has mumble rap on some songs. Uh, you know... Lil Pump does it commonly on some songs. Playboy Cardi does it on most, on most of his songs. It's a style. It can exist. Motherfuckers just want to act like, you know, oh, it can't exist because blah, blah, this, this, that. Like, bro, come on, speed. Just get on somewhere. Like, lit rap, okay. I admit, it's this lean rap. Is this talking about, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you know, the, the, the hype beats. Gunna, pretty much. Gunna, Lil Pump, uh, Lil Uzi Vert, Future. It's like trap. It's like trap, pretty much. It's trap. It's trap talking about partying and shit. Party vibe rap. Okay, so this, now one of the uh, biggest responses that I hear about that, for, for people who want to defend mumpa rap and the lean rap sense that you just defined, people always say that that lyrical spiritual hippity fippity can come off as mumba rap as well. Because people criticize mumba rap for saying, like, I can't even hear what these niggas even saying on the track, bro. They're just mumbling bunch of shit. When it comes to this hippity flippy and shit, we can't hear what y'all niggas are saying on the track. Y'all saying a bunch of fucking words just at a million miles per hour. This can be considered mumble rap too. All the black delicious and papoose and shit. Like that could be looked at mumble rap. It's like bro, if them old if 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 them old heads hated us before, they gonna fucking despise you now because they you just called them niggas mumble rappers. Like it. Shit. I'm saying, like, couldn't that be considered mumble rap just based off their definition? It definitely can. It definitely can. It definitely can. Like, that really just opened my eyes. Just now. I did not even think about it like that, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? Not finishing, like, you're not saying real shit. You're not saying real shit. You're slanting your words. You're not finishing the words. You're not, you know what I'm saying? Like, you, you slant a word so you could fit in another little verb there. I've heard it on so many songs from rappers that no one considers mumble rappers. And honestly, like, you can mumble rap but you don't have to be considered a mumble rapper. Chris Brown can make a fucking rap song and not be considered a rapper. He'll still be considered R&B because that's basically what his discography is heavily, uh, you know, consists of. You know what I'm saying? Much like how Justin Bieber can make an R&B song and not be considered an R&B artist. It's, it's possible. Like, that, that, can, that shit can happen. When so, it comes to people saying the mumble rap shit, uh, now, this can be just the term just wasn't given the most accurate name. But when people say that, oh, we call it mumble rap because we can't even hear what these little niggas is even saying on the track. We, they, they slurring their words, all that kind of shit. A song could be considered a mumble rap song, even though you hear what they're saying. And it goes to what you were saying about the ad libs. Like hearing a nigga make a song and they just talking about jewelry, lean bitches, and they end every line with a, yeah, uh, 
like some shit like that. That even though you hear everything they're saying, it's still considered mumble rap. Like <laughs> that nigga made in exactly. Tokyo, his whole XXL freestyle, he started that shit. <clears throat> this that mumble rap, that mumble rap. Oh heads, we didn't want none of that. Yeah, they don't want none of that. Ooh, they don't want none of that. Like you heard everything the nigga was saying. He wasn't mumbling. It's just because of the ad libs and shit. Yeah, yeah, they don't want none of that. Ooh, they don't want none of that. Like it come off. It it is mumble rap because that was like what people was calling it. This damn mumble exactly. rap. The mumble rap. Oh heads, we didn't want none of that. Yeah, they don't want none of that. <laughs> Now, now that's just stuck. Now that's just stuck in your head. It's not. I'm just surprised that that's like the route he took. Like the oh, fact that yeah. this, this, that's right when the um, 2016 and 17 is right when that whole shit started. People saying mumble rap and all that kind of shit. So this nigga, he right. called that shit out early. <laughs> Man, Tokyo still trash though. So this 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 one's supposed to turn into no. Man, Tokyo podcast. Fuck you. I, I think you the first one to, I think you the first person to recite a main in Tokyo lyric in twenty twenty one. Ever. <laughs> I think you the first one to, Yeah. <laughs> if I even tweet about that, you the probably gonna pull a Rob Stone like like that shit. I know, right? He's gonna be like, you like, yeah, y'all niggas can keep my name out your mouth. Like, I'm gonna talk about you because ain't no one else gonna do it. Well, I know you heard about the Zeus and Ugly Guy shit, bro. Yeah, I did, bro. That shit pissing me off, dog. I went to make a diss track on that nigga so bad, but I'm like, yeah, what, what, what purpose would that serve? But he's so fucking irrelevant now. He probably would have fucking made one back. That's the only reason so, he even see, bro. I don't know if he even, I don't know if he watched the podcast episode with me and Zeus, but he 100 percent saw the title, <laughs> and that's why he got pissed. He had to have, bro. He had to have, and even then, bro, if you're gonna judge based off of the title, now nah, he had to have watched the video because it's like, bro, you can't, like, come on now, nah, bro, you can't do that. Especially given Zeus's age, it's like, bro, really? Like, you really that press a, a, a fucking teenager decide to do homework rather than fucking, you know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> are you serious, bro? Like, come on, bro, there's better shit you gotta do with your life. I, 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 it's probably not. <laughs> one of the next big things. Man, when Zeus told me that ugly guy that DM'd him, and said that he was mad. I didn't even believe that nigga. I'm like, there's no way that this nigga. Will. First of all, I, I, you know what? I do believe him. I'm like, okay, right, I'm pretty sure he's not busy. Like <laughs> that nigga, he's not busy. I'm sure he definitely saw that shit. Nah, bro, he he's good. He's good. He's open for booking right now. He will come to your, <laughs> he will come to your party for a hundred dollars and and perform a water about three times. <laughs> <laughs> He would perform water and all his uh his songs talking about big booty bitches and all that shit <laughs> for your t- for your five year old kids. <laughs> he's, good for all- <laughs> he's good for all your parties. <laughs> he's good for all your parties <laughs> of all ages. <laughs> Only the the kids want that. <laughs> I'm gonna have to make a oh, remix of that fuck ugly guy, shit. bro. That, that nigga made up his own song called <laughs> Fuck Ugly Guy. That shit is too fitting right now. He dissed now. himself. He t- that man, that nigga dissed himself, bro. That's how that's how irrelevant that nigga is, bro. So that nobody else can do it. Man, fuck. Fuck Ugly Guy. You got your ugly ass jumped in high ugly school. Ugly Guy the hoe. You say you got a lot of money, <laughs> but your ass don't. <laughs> That's that it. shit's still true. <laughs> that, not, only, not only is that shit still true, he could probably add some shit to that now. <laughs> right, seventeen year old didn't want to. Seventeen year old didn't want to talk to me. <laughs> now I have to drop my booking fee. Uh, was shit. going, for, was going for a hundred bands. Now I go for a hundred. <laughs> this should have turned into an ugly guy roast. That shit crazy, bro. I don't <laughs> even know how we got to that. I don't even know how we got to this. <laughs> what were we talking about? <laughs> I know we were talking about mumble rap, oh, but I no, really don't know how he veered off at the horn, that nigga. Cause Ray, oh, he really is a whole. Oh, I, to... I was saying I'll money in Tokyo. Probably if I was to tweet about him, he'll see my tweet just like Rob Stone did the other day, and then <laughs> he'll. I said we'll see if he'll probably get mad and respond like other guy did to Zeus. All right, never mind. That nigga Rob Stone, I can't believe that he saw that. Yeah, he I, first of all, I thought he was gonna like pull a Wale and get mad at me for what I said. That, that nigga just likes to tweet. Yeah, thing. bro. You know what the crazy part is, bro? Uh, Kevin Aragon, this nigga told me that um, that uh, this nigga Rob Stone unliked my comment. He unliked a comment? For, how yeah, the fuck he, he even, Why was he looking that deep into it? How would he know that? Here's my thing. No, here's the craziest part about that. Why did he go back twice to that fucking same comment? Why, why is he looking <laughs> at it again? 
He probably went back to the comment section to see if anyone else was talking shit about him. Like, dude, don't oh, worry. Oh, I see. Oh, I see what Kevin is talking about. I got a notification that said Rob Stone liked to reply to your tweet, and it was yo, am I sleeping, Rob Stone? And this nigga, he liked it, then I liked it. Yeah, Kevin is right. He didn't like my response when I said there's only there's only going to be one song to listen to. Damn, Kevin was actually right. I did I do peep this shit because he I got a notification saying he liked it, but when you actually view the likes, his name not right there. Like, bro, that nah, dog. <laughs> I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna front to you, bro. <laughs> well, we, we, never, I could possibly, but I, I swear to God, I could invite Rob Stone to this podcast and he'll pull up. Like, you know, you're not. The, I wish this nigga would turn me down. It'd be like, oh, I'm, busy. <laughs> I'm, I'm busy. I'm busy, homie. I can't do it. Like, busy doing what? You're not in the studio. <laughs> you're not in no studio recording no music, bro. Like, it's not me and the bitch. Come on. Like you know that nigga, you know a nigga like that gotta still be up right now, fucking calling all the rappers talking about some. Uh, how much you charge it for a for a feature right now? Right? <laughs> I can't even. I don't think <laughs> I can even <laughs> name one of the rap song song in the world. But one of he the nigga who um uh had sent one of his goons to run up on the stage and punch X that one time. I think he was. Uh, no, was it, was it him? No, not him. Know, but he's one of his goons. Like one of his homies had ran up on the stage and punched think- X. Like, X had got, like, man. slumps. Like, he, he slumped that nigga. Fuck yeah, that nigga was not moving after that. That shit's crazy as fuck, yo. I, I, I'm not gonna lie, bro. That shit was funny as shit when it happened. I was looking like, bro, this nigga slept. This, like, he came out of nowhere fast as fuck. And fuck. <laughs> I shouldn't even be laughing about this shit, bro. And X had no peripheral, bro. Dude ran up and just he snuck his ass clean as hell. Like, yo, he where he fuck- came from. This nigga came, bro. It's the fact that this nigga was like, you know how nigga, <laughs> you know how you can move your hand fast as shit and like see the fucking like it look like a fucking ghost or some shit. Mm-hmm. This nigga was like Sonic, bro. This nigga, <laughs> this nigga. Fucking Why are you crazy, laughing bro? about X getting shit, bro? That's fucked up, though. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, like you can laugh about it, bro. Like it's it's fucked up, but it's funny, dog. Like you know what I'm saying? Like this nigga came from the. You could barely see this nigga come from the other side of the screen. <laughs> this nigga came from one side of the screen. <laughs> well, I'm actually watching. Are you watching the video right now? You watching it right now? <laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you was because you started describing that shit a little bit too vividly. <laughs> I'm like, this you must be came, looking at it right now. This nigga came from one side of the screen. You you couldn't even see this fucking nigga's fist connect with X's face, bro. <laughs> it <was> so quick. <laughs> this nigga fucking left. <laughs> No, he ended up, I think he, I think he got his ass beat like on the stage. After he punched X, he like fucking like fell as he was running, and they started beating his ass. <laughs> Yo, this, this is crazy. I think what the fuck he think was gonna happen? Like you didn't think you was gonna get your ass beat right after that? <laughs> I'm saying, bro. Yo, I, I remember there was a motherfucking nigga in the crowd talking shit, uh, talking about some uh, what? It was at a, a ski mask concert. This nigga, fuck X, he was a woman beating piece of shit. This nigga fucking ski mask told all the fans to beat that name, that man's ass, bro. Oh, that's fucked up. <laughs> and they, they fight they, in the hospital. <laughs> they beat the, yeah, bro, they beat the shit out of that nigga. And the security guard started to stop this shit. I'm just like, bro, let that nigga get his ass whooped. Man, I am so sorry to any X fans that are watching this video thinking I'm disrespecting that nigga, bro. Like, I literally have some X merch. So, I'm a, I'm a fan, bro, but you can't deny when something's funny. You know what I'm saying? It's funny because, look, nigga, everyone was laughing about that shit. I I forget what the uh, YouTuber's name was, but he, he you know the uh, videos, um, if this rapper was in a class, or if the baby was in your class, or some shit. Oh, yeah, um, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that nigga, yeah. yeah uh, he was, love, live, serve, them niggas. Yeah, that, yeah, the same nigga, bro. He did a skit where X was talking and shit, and even niggas like Andante was laughing at that shit, bro, and, and, and supposedly Andante is that, that nigga's best friend or some shit, so it's like, bro, you know what I'm saying? It, niggas laugh about it. You can't be like, oh, that's not funny culture. Oh, yeah, yeah. Why can one nigga laugh about it and another nigga can't? You know what I'm saying? So it's like, alright, bro, don't, 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 don't try me on that. 